Hi, I'm Gianna, reporting for Kids First, and today I'll be speaking with Jonas Cabriob about Disney's newest animated series, Pup Struction, which premieres June 14, 2023, on Disney Junior, Disney Channel, and Disney Plus. Jonas started his career as an actor in 2019, and he has already been in several projects, including Obi Wan Kenobi, Raven's Home, Blaze in the Monster Machines, and Sweet Tooth, to name a few. He's with me here today to talk about his new project, Pup Struction. In this series, there are different breeds of dogs with unique characteristics. How do you think this adds to their ability to get the job done? Um, sometimes it can be a little hard, you know, maybe they hit a roadblock. Like me, for example, as I said, uh, I'm a tiny corgi and I might be smaller than all of the other pups, but, you know, I get the job done. And also Roxy, who's a dog on wheels. Um, she may have that disability, but she doesn't let that stop her from doing big things, and she always gets the job done. Speaking of being the smallest pup, um, your character Finney is definitely a leader, even though he definitely is the smallest. How are you similar or different to or from Finney? I'm 12. I'm turning 13 soon, and I'm pretty small for my age, um, but I feel like I can also relate to Finney because he's small for his age, and... Mm. Um, he, he's also the smallest out of all of the pups, but he has great determination, has a great can-do attitude, and he, he has great ideas and, and big ideas, and he doesn't let his size limit him from doing all these great things. Based on the personalities of the other dogs, who would you hang out with in real life? I love all of the dogs, so I feel like we could all be one little friend group, you know, Tank, he loves his snacks, and I love to eat snacks as well. And Luna, she's super fun and spontaneous. She has uh, a great energy. And Roxy also, she's super fun. And she always gets the job done. So I feel like I can hang out with all of them. What do you think young audiences will find most interesting about the town of Pittsburgh? Um, the town of Pittsburgh is a very interesting place because, as it's called Pittsburgh, there's all different kinds of animals. There's bunnies, there's fish, there's dogs, there's cats. Uh, yeah, Pittsburgh is a very cute, fun uh, pet, pet, pets city or pets town. And there's plenty of different pets in there. And I think if Pittsburgh was a real thing, I would love to go visit. Pittsburgh is also very colorful and fun. Which was the most fun episode for you to do? One of my favorite episodes was probably the one where I'm helping um, a bunch of kids get to school safe and sound. I'm not going to say it much other than that. I don't want to get in trouble, but you know, yeah, that was probably my favorite one. What was your most memorable part of working on this project? Ooh, um, singing, definitely singing, because as I mentioned in the beginning, I'm actually bought my piano right here. I play piano and I sing, and that's a very memorable moment, just working with Rob, who uh, produces all of the music, makes great songs for all of the shows, and I love working with him because I love singing uh, all of the songs and just listening to them for the first time. I'm just super excited for that. And finally, there are a few important themes that stand out in the series. What message do you want audiences to take away from watching the show? So the show age ranges from two to seven. So for those for those kids, um, I feel like I hope that they take away lots of community, uh, commu or, sorry, talking um, skills and creative problem solving skills and working together as a team and family and to never give up even when they hit a roadblock. That's a great message for people to take out, even I can take it out. Thank you for speaking with me today. Yeah, thank you for having me, Gianna. Thank you. Thank you, Jonas Cabrillo, for speaking with me today. We just talked about Pup Struction, which releases on Disney Junior, Disney Channel, and Disney Plus on June 14th, 2023. Be sure to check it out. I'm Gianna reporting for Kids First. Make sure you like and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss my next interview, review, or one of those of my awesome teammates. Bye!